Uwe ultimately a defeat tonight, but you must be incredibly proud of what you've seen from your team. Yeah, um, Rob, Rob said something very interesting uh, in terms of attempts on goals, in terms of uh, call it so-called opportunities. We've probably been better three halves out of the four in two to two ties, but in the last one, in the most decisive half, they had too much force. Very, very happy with the way we played the first half. Um, we made some changes up front, but it was was uh, definitely working. Uh, Corner and Jordi, uh, Ash Handers in the moment a very good in a very good place. So uh, we kept them away. We had two or three good opportunities where we tested their keeper. They didn't test it our keeper at all, and then unfortunately we didn't look very good at the last at their first goal. But that can happen when you be permanently under pressure. Second half, they had too much for us. The Premier League team, eight in the league, in the Premier League, and you could see that in the second half. And ultimately, we've also played a part in a bit of football in history. VAR goal, for the second goal, what would you take on that? I said that now, I'm not, I'm not, a, I'm a traditionalist. I'm, I, I think you should keep the game simple, pure. Uh, that is why the game is so beautiful. You know, try to reinvent the game again and um, I can understand why they're doing it. I want to help the referee, but some the, the thing for me is what I'm uh, what I'm uh, a little bit annoyed is is when you have VAR and at some situations you're still guessing. At some situations you're still not seeing 100 percent, 110 percent what actually happened, and um, and then you make you guessing, and uh, then let the referee guess in the first place because to football belongs also human errors and. But I repeat, we was not, we didn't lose the game because of that situation. Leicester was in the second, in the second half today, the clear better team. In the second half, as you say, they were the better team. But in the first half, we looked really, really good, certainly on the counter attack. Yeah. And that goal probably just came at the wrong time, didn't it, for them? We invested a lot defensively, but we looked good when we had the ball. We was slick passing, and we kept the ball better. And in the second half, we was running out of steam a little bit. I felt when we would have gone nil-nil in, that would have probably given us even more energy for the second half. We probably could hold it them a little bit more, more back. But um, we move on. We had a great run, fantastic run for the football club, for the players. Great experience today, and you saw our players. They stood up at least in three out of the four halves and made themselves proud, and our football club proud. When you reflect on this cup run final, it's been a really successful one on and off the pitch for us, and it's given us that profile. And as we've seen tonight, it's been rewarding for the players as well. Yeah, definitely. And um, uh, players should just brush it off. And um, I said, well done over over the two legs. Well done to everybody. And uh, now concentrating on on Blackburn Rovers. We invested a lot today, and uh, we just to make sure that we get ready for them. For well done tonight.